right. Let's see if they are here. Straight out of the thrift store, looking for toys galore. My name is Burf and this is my turf. I'm straight out of the thrift store. Hey, what's up? It's your boy Burf, and I am at the Stonebriar Mall right now. I'm about to head into Jaden's Toys. And the reason for my trip today is I was over at Games, Cards, and Comics over the weekend, and I ended up purchasing this Inhumanoid Metlar figure, which was originally $184, and I got him for $20 because he had fallen off the shelf. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it up here. Uh, he had fallen off the shelf at the toy store and he got busted up. So they had him in the back. They weren't going to sell him. And then they told me, I said, well, if you want him for 20 bucks, he's yours. And so I grabbed him and I was able to piece him back together. And uh, now I own a Metlar. <laughs> so, but anyway, it got me in the mood for some more like bigger toys, you know, not as big as him. He's pretty big, but uh I remember when I was at Jaden's last week, there was these, this Jason and the Argonauts Talos figure, and then uh, uh, Sinbad, the Voyage of Sinbad. All right, well, it is another gorgeous day, and uh, it looks like the doors are closed, actually. It's not quite noon yet. I think the mall opens or the stores open at noon on Sunday. So let's go wait in line and then we'll skedaddle in there and see if we can find some goodies. So I entered through Dillard's, I believe, but the door is still shut to the mall. So we have to wait for somebody to come open it. Come on. All right, well, here we are, Jaden's Toys. All right. Let's see if they are here. Well, here's a Cyclops. And here is Thalos. All right. Very cool. We're definitely going to pick both of these up. Yeah, I couldn't leave without getting some of this footage of these Godzillas. Oh man, this one here is my favorite. This one's really cool. To grab this guy at some point too. Yeah, he's a must at some point. At some point. Okay, so before I left, I rummaged through this bin to check out these bootleg Thundercats that I found in here. These things are awesome. I'm gonna pick these up too. All right, well, I got what I came for and then some. I'm excited, I'm kind of jazzed up right now. <laughs> These figures are so cool. But uh, all right, so we're gonna head home and do a little show and tell. All right, well, we're home, so let's head in and set up shop. All right, guys, well, this is my haul from Jaden's Toy Store, and I, absolutely love these figures these things are so cool i did make a mistake i thought this was the cyclops but it's actually the minotaur from the golden voyage of sinbad these are ray harry Housen figures and this figure is eight inches tall then over here we've got talos from jason and the argonauts which is one of my favorite movies it is uh and it's a classic. If you haven't seen Jason and the Argonauts, I highly recommend it. It is a really great movie. It even has like claymation in it, uh, stop motion. Really, really cool movie. But he stands about eight to nine inches as well. And then down here, we've got the Thundercats, baby. So we've got some bootleg Thundercats. So this is Lion-O. And then over here, We've got Chitara, who's looking amazing. And then over here, 
we've got Mumra. I actually want to go back to Jaden's and dig through the bin and see if I can find the rest of these figures. See if I can find Tigra and Panthor. I think they would be great additions to this collection. And I don't know if there's maybe possibly some other figures in that bootleg line that I could maybe snag up. But let's take a look at the Minotaur here. I'm gonna kind of move him out of the way. These guys are probably gonna fall over. But uh, he doesn't, whoa, <laughs> whoops. He doesn't stand real well on his own. This back leg right here is kind of turned in a little bit. So I'm probably gonna need to like put him in water, some hot boiling water and see if I can maybe bend that figure. I'm sorry, bend that leg into position where he can stand on his own. Cause right now I have to lean him up against something. But what an awesome sculpt. And then let's grab Talos back here, take a little better look at him. Fling him around to his back here. You can see his spine is kind of protruding through a little bit. And uh, this guy was made out of stone. And if I remember correctly, there was a little button on his heel that you could push in or something like that and it caused him to collapse if i remember correctly it's been a while since i've seen the movie it is one of my favorite movies in this line of movies um clash of the titans jason and the argonauts the voyage the golden voyage of sinbad all great movies but i'm gonna have to go back and re-watch some of these man what an awesome figure though but hey, if you're enjoying watching this content as much as I'm enjoying making it for you, do me a favor, smash that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you're always first to be notified of the next episode. Also, like and comment on this video. Let me know if you've seen any one of those movies, Jason and the Argonauts, The Golden Voyage of Sinbad, or Clash of the Titans. And if so, which one was your favorite? Also, give me a follow on Instagram and Tiggity Talk at 80s Toys Rock and Rock is spelled R-O-C! In the meantime, I'll catch you on the flip side.